It is our third week now of extreme heat. For local businesses, this is having a significant impact on their operations. Yeah, Alexandra Coenyards is live in Manitou Park with the latest impact this heat wave has had on local businesses in Spokane and how we can all continue to support them. Yeah, Derek and Kirsten, as you can see behind me, people have started to gather for the Northwest Bach Fest, an outdoor concert which starts in just about 30 minutes. Now, this event, just like many others in the Inland Northwest, has felt the impact of this heat wave. Today, I spoke with some local businesses in the area who tell me that the drop in customers these past few weeks has been unprecedented and that working in this heat is simply intolerable. And people don't come out, you know, when it gets to be 100 degrees, 100 plus people stay home in the air conditioning. So. It's hot and many of us want nothing more than just that. Stay cool inside. But for local businesses who typically thrive during the summer, a heat wave like this can make it hard to do day to day work. It makes us really like tired and kind of like I don't know, I know for a fact that I've been like ringing people up and like completely blanking on like orders and stuff because I'm just like, it's so hot, I don't know what I'm doing. Carrie Connor, manager of Park Bench Cafe, made the decision to close early last week due to the extreme heat. This is unfortunately something other businesses in the area have had to do as well, meaning hours had to be cut and possible changes to employees' wages. But this time Blue Moon Garden and Nursery, another local business just a few miles away, had to close early twice last week because of the heat. Owner Therese Palaya says this will most likely be the case again this weekend. Well, it's pretty quiet, um, but, you know, we're getting some business, but it's it's definitely off. This month, Palaya says revenue for her business has dropped by around 60 percent. Although heat is expected during the summer, Connor says it usually does not start this early in the year. You know, it keeps lasting and it, it does continue to impact. Now with August just a few weeks away, there's concerns of how this heat might continue to impact business. Both of the local businesses I spoke with encourage people to continue supporting them. One way of doing this is by going earlier while it's still cool out. Reporting live in Manitou Park, Alexandra Coenyards for News Now.